million thoughts race through Ratchet's head. Could he repair this diminutive war box? Would it be the key to the adventure he craved? Did he leave the proto engine on in the garage? The answer to all these questions was yes. All right, hang on. I'll get us back to the garage. <laughs> Large gaps were child's play to Ratchet. All he would need to get across is a trusty swing shot and a little bravado. Fortunately for our furry hero, a conveniently placed crate provided Ratchet with a combustor. Nice! A combustor! Ratchet basked in the freedom of being able to switch weapons whenever he felt like it. could shoot something to open the door. My sensors indicate there is a switch across the way that can be activated with a combustor shot. All Ratchet had to do was shoot the target, but he thought long and hard before pulling the... Impressive shooting. Nice work. Stand out and find it. You're going down, Lombax. Uh oh, Blark. What are they doing here? I have information in my data banks that poses a threat to Chairman Dredd. He must have tracked my position to your planet so he could get it back. Grim, listen to me. I want you to lock the garage doors and then head down into the shelter. I'll be there as soon as I can. Copy that, Ratchet. Ratchet is in a bad way. Hurt, confused, and alone. He scoured the Kizzle Plateau for signs of nanotech. Yes! Got it! I think yeah. that's all of them. Dropship? Correct. Model X6V to be exact. Also known as the Dropship of Death. Great. Grim's garage. Grim, are you okay? I'm fine, kid, but I ain't opening up until the coast is clear. Just hold tight, Grim. I got this.
Dropship detected. educational purposes. It is always good to meet a fellow academic. Really, I just look at the pictures and then, you know, wing it. Can you open up? Ratchet, what in Zoni's name just exploded? Sorry about that, Grim. Listen, get my tools ready. I just found something in the desert I need to look at. Interesting. What kind of factory is this? This? No, oh, this is just a garage. Lived here since I was a kid. Come on, let's get you fixed up. That's strange. I'm picking up something from Navalis. It appears to be some sort of distress signal, but it is being jammed using a Blargian signal dampener. Don't worry. The computer would have told us if we were in any real danger. Fatal crash imminent. Would you like to record your last will and testament? Admittedly, that's not super promising. Well, it's damaged, but I fixed worse. Come on, maybe there's someone in town who can help us. Wait a second, is that rare titanium? Maybe we should upgrade our weapons first. Now here's where you pick your weapon. Let me walk you through the process with one of mine. Take your time. No, really. You're gonna need rare titanium for this stuff, but we'll use some of mine for now. All you gotta do is pick one of them cells. Are these things chained together. Go ahead and fill out the whole chain. All right, just confirm the transaction and the deal's done. Cluster. Now that's gonna give you a big boost. That's all there is to it. Give it a spin on one of your own.
And jump and j seriously, what's with all the jumping?
Sonic, these dogs dog have had the transmission. Who's gonna save us now? Oh, hello there. I'm glad you're here. I've been... Hey, have we met before? Because I'm getting a touch of the old deja vu. Uh, I don't think so. Huh. Well, guess the old think tank could use a good plumbing. <laughs> Anywho, I've been trying to get a distress call to the Galactic Rangers ever since Drax forces showed up. Uh, this entire region is overrun with Blargy and dropships. We need to get you out of here. Well, I can't go anywhere until I get this here info bot into the hands of Captain Quark. We were on our way to speak with him when our ship was shot down. Perhaps we could take a look. Oh, sure thing. I swabbed it from one of those Blarg soldiers. Here you go. Oh, hello there. I'm Alonzo Drek, chairman of Drek Industries. Many of you may be wondering, why are 300 heavily armed warbots marching ominously towards a Class G dreadship? <laughs> the answer is simple, friends. Progress. Years ago, we were driven underground by pollution that may or may not, but most definitely was, caused by my father's company. Since then, we've shifted focus from robotics to planet building. Now that our project is nearing completion, we must do everything possible to stay on schedule. In this case, it means our friendly army of warbots must vanquish those who would seek to stop us. Good news? They don't know we're coming! So sit back, relax, and take comfort in the knowledge that Drek Industries is working for you! Drek Industries is not working for you.